good morning everybody it is the monday before christmas um decode was going to be in office this week but clearly we are not right now um our ceo told us all to work from home so that is what we were doing we're going to ignore my chin this week um we're working on fixing it um, and also maybe ignore my hair if I really just leave it at eye level because I'm also going to try something new. Um, yeah, this week is already very light. Um, very much needing to find new things to do from other people because I have one task that I'm working on with somebody else. Um, and it won't take us very long to finish it. Um, so I guess I will be tracking a lot to continuing education this week um, and seeing where that leads us. But yeah, it's the week before the holidays, so we're, it's, I'm getting the sense that we're kind of like tidying things up um, because a lot of due dates um, were last week and this week, um, so that's why we don't have a whole lot to do. Um, but yeah, this is Kelly's last week with Decode, um, so she is offboarding a lot of stuff to the three of us on our team. Well, actually, Sarah's out. Um, so she did a lot of that talk with Sarah last week. Um, and yeah, we... I was hoping for one more week in the office with Kelly, but I guess that's not gonna happen, um, which is a little bit sad, but yeah. I will be watching a lot of Christmas movies this week as well. I have my Christmas tree on. Um, which I'm actually pretty excited that I get to work from home this week because I am leaving for Flower Mound on Christmas Eve, which is Friday because we have that day off. So it's a four day work week. Um, and yeah, so I'm excited that my Christmas tree is lit up. I'm feeling very festive this week. It's gonna be a great time, even though I won't have a lot to do. Um, but I will keep you guys updated and talk to y'all later. Bye. Well, not bye, but like, See you later. I will talk to you guys later. Hello, it is now 11.40. We're taking a little break to eat some lunch, some leftover pizza that I had from yesterday. Um, and yeah, just finished, Emily and I finished those um, meta descriptions. And now we got some answers back for some physician questions that we needed for a blog. So that's what I'm gonna be spending the rest of the day on. Um, and yeah, had a social and content team meeting just to kind of update each other on the projects that we have going on. Um, but I'm taking a short little break to eat my pizza, hang out with Stanley, and watch some of the Shrink Next Door. It is an Apple TV Plus series, um, and it's got Paul Rudd and Will Ferrell in it. It's pretty good. It's based on a real story um, that a podcast made first. And now they made it into a TV series. So it's pretty interesting so far. Good morning everybody. It is now Tuesday. It's cold outside and I decided to change things up a little bit um, for today's office setting. It's gonna look different throughout the day. Cause this morning Stanley and I are gonna go and work at the dog park. Um, since it's like during work hours there shouldn't be too many people there um, so I should be able to get work done. Um, if not we'll just come right back because it's not that far from my apartment. Um, but it is like 43 degrees outside, so I'm wearing my 
favorite blue turtleneck and some black joggers and some of my old Converse, um, just in case it's a little bit muddy at the dog park. And I don't want to get any of my other shoes ruined. But yes, I have a blog to finish today and some updates to leadership calendars to make. Um, so hopefully we can knock out as much of that this morning as we can. And that we can do other things this afternoon. Um, because I do have one meeting this morning and then one meeting this afternoon, I believe. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys at today's office, which is the dog park. So it was very cold out there um, and I did not prepare enough. So Stanley and I, I'm gonna finish writing the blog that I'm working on in the car where it's warm. Um, but this will also still keep, Stanley got a lot of running in, which I'm very thankful for. Um, but this will also still keep him awake and like on alert as he <laughs> looks around at all of the things happening. It's so cute, look at him. What a cutie. I love you, Stanley. Ah! After my afternoon meeting has gotten moved a couple times around the afternoon, it has now gotten pushed to tomorrow. So I officially have hardly anything to do this afternoon. I finished the blog, sent it off to Kelly for review, waiting on edits to come back from her, um, did some brainstorming for topics, um, for social posts, and um, made edits to uh, leadership calendars that I needed to. And now we are straight chilling. Um, Kelly has sent me and Kat a new project for um, one of our national clients, um, but it's not due until next week, end of next week even, so there's no like rush on it, um, but I think Kat kind of needs stuff to do as well, um, and so she told me that she's eating lunch now and then we can like talk about this if we want to whenever she gets back so probably do that hopefully she'll get back soonish or like within the next hour and a half because that's when I want to head to a coffee shop and visit one of my friends at work um, and say hi and get a hot chocolate maybe a pastry Stanley is finally deciding to entertain himself with a toy um, but yeah so far, I've been scrolling through LinkedIn, finding things that I could post or reshare, just coming up with more like personal branding ideas, things like that, things for the new year that will be coming in a new video soon. So be on the lookout. I will be posting New Year's related content. Um, so yeah, let's see what else this afternoon holds for us. Hello, we are back home. Um, I went to, oh my gosh, the coffee house at West End. What is going on with my hair right now? Anyways, I went to the coffee house at West End Church um, because my friend Maggie works there as a barista. So while I have this opportunity to be working wherever I want, I wanted to go and say hi to her. Um, so that is what I did. Could also. You, I also needed a little bit of a break from Stanley. He was just too much. Um, and just so needy, wanting my attention. 
attention. Um, but yeah, so we're back home. While I was at the coffee house, I mostly just scrolled through LinkedIn, reading some articles, educating myself um, on all of the things. And yeah, I actually really enjoyed it. Found some good articles that I saved in my Notion. Um, I will try to remember this, that I want to link those articles or like my index of my Notion down there for you guys to go and look at them if you wanted to. Um, they're like professional um, type articles about like, one of them was about soft skills and like how um, more and more jobs are being automated. It was written a couple years ago, but like more and more jobs are being automated, but it's those soft skills that are very important and will like keep a person seen as a valuable asset. Um, and then another one was about like the differences between large and small companies, which I thought was really useful and I could have really used that one when I was um, looking for a job or like more recently graduated and not a year out of college. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to think of if I did anything else while I was there or this afternoon um, because I did make some edits to that blog, got it sent off to Nicole, so it's done. We're waiting on one more. Um, piece before it's like fully done um, but yeah then social reviewed those posts and got that all taken care of um, and then I reviewed an infographic that I wrote for another blog it looked fantastic I'm so excited for it to be published um, and yeah after doing those things I just scrolled on LinkedIn and uh, read some articles there's still some more that I saved that I want to go back and look at some more um, but yeah if you want to I'm trying to be a little bit more active on LinkedIn so if you want to follow me on LinkedIn we can be buddies you can either like follow me if you just want to see the content that I put out or we can be connections and make friends um, and like help each other out professionally I'm always down to make friends um, so yeah, if you don't, go give, go check me out on LinkedIn if you want to. Be uh, nice. Um, but anyways, that is the end of my Tuesday um, working. And now I'm back home watching more of Julian the Phantoms. I'm very sad that Netflix did not renew for a season two of Julian the Phantoms, but did renew for a season two of Emily in Paris which comes out tomorrow and I will be watching it even though I'm upset that they gave us a season two of Emily in Paris and not Julian the Phantoms. <laughs> this, the Julian the Phantom soundtrack was literally on my uh, Spotify wrapped, like top five artists. The cast of Julian the Phantoms was up there. I was like, why am I not surprised? <laughs> um, but yeah, productive day. I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Happy Wednesday. Stanley and I went to the dog park this morning so he could get some energy out. It went fabulously. Um, I, since it's after nine now, I like did a little bit of work there. Um, I was like catching up on news and just stuff surrounding COVID. Um, and yeah, that's what I did at the dog park. Um, today I've got to finish out some recommendations for some native articles for some blogs that we've already written and then I will be working on a um, heart month infographic. Um, I'll be working on an infographic um, for one of our national clients um, and yeah it's it doesn't have a whole lot of direction so I can have a lot of fun with it and so I'm excited about this project. Um, yeah, I'll probably talk to you guys more about it later. Um, so I'm gonna get to work. <laughs> I'm so sad that Kelly is leaving. Right when we're getting all of these big projects. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna cry. It'll be fine though, it'll be fine.
Good morning. Not Kelly making me cry in our last one on one. Oh my gosh. I'm so sad that she's leaving. But she gave me some great tips and some things to work on. Kelly has been such a wonderful boss, and I'm gonna miss her so much. Uh, but she gave me some tips on things to work on and get better at. And also just said that. <laughs> this is so sad. <laughs> but she also said that I was a joy to work with and a talented writer and reminded her of herself when I was hurt when she was my age. So that's why I'm crying. <laughs> Kelly, you're so nice. I'm gonna miss you so much. Our last snacks for snacks with Kelly. But maybe we'll get to meet Andy again. Hello. Stanley and I just took some pictures in front of the tree. Well, it's a video that I'm going to take screenshots of, so like the quality won't be the best, but it's the best I can do by myself. Um, because it is Christmas Eve Eve. And yeah, midway through the day, I'm taking my lunch break. And yes, I finished an infographic for Heart Month. I am picturing it in my mind. I think it's gonna look really cool, but we'll see. And then um, I finished a vlog for a patient story. Um, that was also a YouTube video that I worked on yesterday. It's a, such a sweet story. Um, and yeah. Had my one-on-one -on -one with Kelly. She made me cry. Had snacks for snacks. Um, we talked about templated blogs. And yeah. Gonna work on some native ads this afternoon before we don't work tomorrow. And we're off um, until the Tuesday after Christmas. I'm also watching Home Alone while I work and while I'm about to eat lunch, so yep, I'm hoping to also use this break to get some things done since I'm going home tomorrow morning and I need to vacuum, clean up, because Stanley's toys are everywhere, aren't they? Yeah, they are. Um, I need to take out the trash, clean out the fridge, and do some dishes, and I still need to pack. But a lot of my packing will be laundry that I need to do because it's been about three weeks since I've done laundry. Which is why I've been in this sweatshirt basically this whole week. Oh my gosh. <gasps> That's okay though. But I am going to eat lunch and then get back to work. <laughs> 